It was great uh, being able to move the ball up and down the field. And whenever it got to third down, we're not just going three and out. So we're extending drives and keeping the defense off the field. So uh, it was great football. And Isaiah was getting you guys kind of staying ahead of the sticks. You weren't in those third and long situations. How important was that, just kind of leaning on him early in the early on downs? Well, no, it was, it was, it was extremely important. Um, he came in and he started this week, and he knew he had a job he had to do. And I told him in certain situations, like, you got to get it no matter what. So. It was definitely uh, must win downs that he had to do what he had to do. Will was just in here saying how he didn't think it would be wise to start a game with an onside kick against an offense as explosive as yours, and your dad was also surprised by it. What were your thoughts when they when they started like that and gave you a short field goal? Oh, I just didn't. I didn't know why they did that. You know, but it was, it, it was probably he probably thought it through and was like, oh, we're gonna get it back and. I don't know. That was just—it's just risk. It's just risk you take, you know. This far through, oh, sorry, but this far through the season, do you feel like your offense is developing more and more and more to the point where you feel comfortable, maybe more so than the start of the year, with where you're at now offensively with your system? I wouldn't say that. I would say each 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 task is different. You go through different things with uh, just uh, the same group of guys, so it's more. It's more work, like uh, more like task on him. You know, you got you got more chemistry with everybody when in real life situations. So um, I feel like that's all it is. Yeah, I mean that's just the expectation. Um, Coming here, the players are transferred in. They understand, you know, everything is not going to be easy. And especially the the way how the games were early on, you know, we had a little bit of everything, you know, so it prepared us for now, the second half of our season. Two-parter, when was the last time you saw the game? Oh, uh, it had been a minute. He was, he was in Denver one time whenever they played the Broncos, and I wasn't able to. Hang out with him, but I, I, last time I seen him, it was it was a long time ago. How good was that that season for you, especially with you guys going in? Oh uh, no, it was amazing. I told him every time I see his chain, it's like I I want that exact chain that he has. So that's 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 what I was more excited to see was his chain than him, <laughs> almost. But uh, now I was always excited to see him. I told him, you know, this off season we're gonna definitely uh, be out here working out and training. So. Yeah. Obviously, uh, two freshmen yeah. walk on just meaningful snaps out there. What, what's his development been like? Really good. Cash is a funny guy overall. He's, he's he's just a character. I wish he was in here to talk, you know, so y'all be entertained. But he, he he's a real funny guy, and I'm just excited. You know, he stepped in the role, and he handled his business. Coach Jamal Bryan, uh, Shakur, I know you're a perfectionist. And, uh, so when you look at this game, obviously it's a big win. Like your dad even pointed out during the ball control was not great, a couple interceptions. How much did that affect you? Did that bother you? And then what do you think was going on at this point? Uh, overall, I'm, right now I'm just focused on the win. You know, I'm focused on, you know, situations could be way worse. We could have had what happened when we played Stanford, you know, happen. You know, so we would be worried about way more things than, than a couple mistakes. So we're going to clean those up, to watch the film just during the week and talk, you know, our way through everything. And, the why and get all that figured out, but I think most importantly, we're going to focus on the win um, and just be thankful that we that that we have this opportunity to be happy after the game. Last one for you, Jacob. Miller recruited the Broncos to Colorado in the off season. What's it like to spend half the season now with them and have them fun with you guys again? Yeah, no, it's real fun. It's real fun. Early on, early on is a little tough, you know, because um, he he he. A great receiver, and it was really all the receivers. It, it, it was tough early on, you know, getting everybody adjusted to knowing that the ball is going to get spread around everywhere. It's just, it's just patience, you know. So uh, you you get a guy that came from FAU where he was, you know, the best receiver there, getting all the targets to now everybody is a great player, you know. So 
that was the only thing at first that he understand coming here, you know, my, my, everything's going to go down a little bit, you know, so then he finally, he worked his way into um, the best situations for him, the best situations and him knowing, okay, this is my play, okay, this is his play and everybody really playing complimentary as a receiver group. Uh, that's what's most important. That's why it's so, it hurts us the most, you know, we lost, oh, we, we lost um, 82 Terrell because those, everybody plays their part. You know, when, when one guy goes down, when Travis is out, you know, that that's when um, a lot of other guys go in. So that's why it's real sad that, you know, O is out and Terrell is out. But the freshmen, they got in, they, they stepped up, they made some catches, they did what they had to do. But yeah, overall, it's just, it, it's fun. Everybody understands the playing style. Everybody understands each other now. So we're just gonna always play to their strengths. Thank you, sir. Thank, Thank you. Sir. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate you. it, guys. Now we're done.